everybody, and welcome back to Poetic Philosophy, episode 96. This is the Halloween episode. It's a little late because this is the third time that I recorded this podcast because the audio of the other two shows were just not right, and I just wanted the audios of this to be just perfect. This is a little bit different than your average Halloween podcast. The poems that I picked in this uh, in this show tell another story of these times. It tells of a story of cycles and of transformation. It tells of a story of spiritual growth. It tells a story that reflects this time of 2023 that we live. The song will not be played. Uh, the song at the end of this podcast will not be played on YouTube, but you can hear this show is in its entirety at my X feed, on my Twitter, my X feed at podcast bard or x.com forward slash podcast bard. And you can also go to my iHeart feed and over at iHeart, I am Jedi Poets Podcast, and you can hear it there. So thank you for listening, and enjoy the show. The song at the end of this podcast is Now and Later by Carla Albrich. She's one of the musicians over at thefump.com. And what is thefump.com, you say? Well, it stands for the Funny Music Project, and it's where many musicians write funny music about this life that we all live. And let's face it, there are many things to laugh about in today's world. So if you're sad, depressed, frustrated, and are looking for a release and just want to laugh, check out the Funny Music Project at thefump.com. The Wheel of Fortune by Robert G. Parent Summer's harvest has come, the cold wind begins to blow, the journey has brought us home, while we sit by the fire's glow. We dream of the summer's fun, we rest from the summer's work, the journey's now done, we have come upon life's fork. Orion looks down from the sky, and see what is done and not done. With our riches we can fly, or... We can have truth be undone. The Wheel of Time by Robert G. Parent The woman lost in the woods, running to a place unknown, metaphors of us all, lost in the psyche, the cycle of lives. In between one life, one way, two roads in a yellow wood, traveling down the same, wandering the cycle of the woods, running to no place, no time, the hamster in his wheel, like in Hotel California, where you can die, but never leave. Eyes in the Darkness by Robert G. Parent In the blackness of the void, knowledge remains unseen. Stumbling into others, we trip on our own feet. What direction to go is what we ask. The light of soul is forgotten. Deep inside the darkness within lies the past that remembered, the part that sees. These eyes in the darkness hold our truth and wait for the light, the light of loving, the light of knowing. The Crow by Robert G. Parent the crow by my window comes to tell me of a way, the way of the spirit that lays beyond that which is seen. The crow by my window gives to me a message from the beyond, from the other world, beyond our perceptions, our current perceptions. The crow by my window comes to tell me its secrets that we once knew before entree into this reality and faded just below our current perceptions. The crow by my window comes to tell me I am not alone, that there are others who understand of that beyond the physical realm. The crow by my window comes to tell me the whole story of realities. Time of Transition 
by Robert G. Parent. I enter a new place, look out on the lake, colors reflecting a gentle breeze whispers. Come, enter the new time, a time beyond Orion's gate, where spirit and matter meet, where the wheel of time returns. To this new time I come, and see visions of the past and future. In this time of change, the wind continues to whisper. You have grown spiritually and ready for the next stage. Your great open sight has earned you the right. I feel a stirring within, and before me I see my reality shift as the wind whispers again. This is a universal truth, the big picture of it, where we are all connected in reality's dream. This is a time of year where we transition to the next stage of our growth, becoming what we decide to become in reality's playground, our dream, our hope, our reality. My Transformation by Robert G. Parent I come into a new beginning as the seed breaks through the soil. From the light of soul nourishes the seed. The old has passed away, been transformed into the new. My body's been transformed. My inner being comes into form. Life's flower takes hold. I walk a new path, giving hope to those who follow. I live the joy of true expression. I bring wisdom from the cold ground in soul's dream time as for a cycle of sleep's classroom. My body's been transformed. The outer reflects the inner. I grew as a flower from the soul's light, showing my beauty to those who follow because they too are a flower in life's garden. Oh, and I almost forgot. Stay creative in the magic of life. Thank you for listening. Have a good day.